I was delighted that Wiesterleg wanted to take a material and its process into a new field, which is light in unison with these materials. You know, we're talking here at Wiesterleg primarily about, you know, porcelain. We're talking about ceramics. I mean, ceramics have a heritage which is incredible um, in terms of the history of design. So time often gives importance to things, I think. Uh, you know, age, age in an oil painting, age in a musical instrument. So you've got Wiesterleg, which, you know, was established in 1824. So for all of that time, you know, age has played a role in, in the provenance of when you buy something. You know, you think, gosh, I'm buying from this fantastic heritage. Well, you know, a program like this, I'm trying to find a typology and the technology with a new language, a new design language that you really feel is contemporary, but can only come from a company that has invested so much time in its history of quality and skill. We're dealing with porcelain, which has to be engineered to get that thickness right in order for the right amount of light to pass through it, to work out what points, how to machine, where, why, so that it really works, you know. But then you blow a piece of glass and it's plus or minus, I don't know, three millimeters, everything can change. So there needs to be um, an acceptance in the process, but they are digitally generated and that gives them a degree of visual complexity, as in, great architecture and you know light should not be complicated you know it should have a thereness you know you know when the sun goes down what we do comes up <laughs>